Proposition 37 says that triangles which are on the same base and in the same parallels are equal to one another. So let ABC and DBC be triangles on the same base, BC. So this will be the common base, BC. And in the same parallels, AD and BC. So what's going on here is that this is going to be A, and this will be D. And we form our two triangles. So we have the triangle ABC and DCB or DBC. The claim is that these two triangles, which are on the same base and in the same parallels, since AD is parallel to BC, the claim is that these two triangles are equal. And to prove this, we're going to let AD be produced in both directions to E and F. So we'll produce AD over to the left, let's say to E, and produced to the right over to F. So this is going to be E, and this will be F. And through B, let BE be drawn parallel to CA. So we're going to draw BE so that it's parallel to CA, which we can do by Proposition 31. We simply join these two. So BE is going to be parallel to CA. And likewise, CF is going to be drawn parallel to BD. Again, using Proposition 31. Therefore, E, B, C, A, and D, B, C, F are both parallelograms. And they must be equal, and gives his reasoning, for they are on the same base, namely B, C, and then the same parallels B, C, and E, F, which is this one over here, which falls from Proposition 35. So we have equality between the two parallelograms E, B, C, A, and D, B, C, F. There's D, B, C, F. These two parallelograms are equal. Now notice that the original triangle A, B, C is half this parallelogram because we proved in Proposition 34 that the diameter namely AB, bisects the parallelogram. That's why ABC is half. The same reasoning for this other parallelogram. The triangle DBC is half this whole parallelogram, DBCF, because its diameter bisects it. But the halves of equal things are equal to one another. Therefore, we have the equality of the triangle ABC and DBC. Therefore, triangles which are on the same base, namely BC, and in the same parallels, in this case BC and EF, are equal to one another. Therefore, we have equality between our original two triangles, ABC and DBC.